Hey everybody, Dave Forehand, Dallas Arboretum. I'm here in the incredible edible garden here at the Roy Myers Children's Adventure Garden. I wanted to talk about another edible plant uh, that I just love to grow, and I think you would too if you tried it. Uh, it's starting to fruit right now. This is good old artichoke. If you look, you can see the bloom coming out right here, and that's what you harvest. So an artichoke is just the bud flower of this the particular artichoke plant. Uh, for best success here for us in North Texas, you want to plant uh, the artichoke plant in the late fall, around October, November, in a full sun spot, and then uh, give it a little bit of fertilizer at that time when you plant it, and then just kind of let it go. And it'll slowly grow all winter. Uh, now, if we have a real hard, fast cold or an ice event, it'll freeze the plant back, but it will regenerate and come back again. And then by late spring, you're gonna get full-size plants like you see here, and then you'll begin to get the bloom spikes. And as you harvest, the ones that are ripe, when ripe just means they're big in size, just like you'd find them in the store, it'll send up little side shoots and you'll get more and more. So from a large plant, you may get uh, 10 or 12 uh, artichoke blooms. And it's a lot of fun to do it. Uh, there's another variety that people use a lot. It's called the cardoon. It's the wild form of the artichoke. And those are more for decorative purposes. People like this big silver vase-like shape of the artichoke plant in their landscape for a winter uh, foliage. So you want to make sure you get a named variety of artichokes uh, when you do that. And the garden centers would have those and you could find them in the fall. So I'll remind you again, they'll do a video in the fall and tell you it's time to get those artichokes. But I wanted you to see it right now in the spring and bloom and keep it in your mind for next year for your uh, winter garden. I'm Dave Ford and I'll see you real soon.